things. Yeah, when we do a uh, ball practice, we, we do a little bit more where everybody you know gets to play a little more. So and that, and that's good, but uh, it's good for the young guys to get in there and get some reps and get experience with some of the older guys. So it's not just you know th if all the threes take the one reps, it's really still the threes, you know. But when you rotate them in there, they get some reps with the more experienced guys. And, and there's some things that you can learn from the experienced guys that you can't with the threes. What, what do you want to get at? I, I want I just want to get better every day, you know. Um, but the, the bull the bull practice is good because you know it brings the team together, which is you know such a long season, it, you know team team wears down over you know, however many weeks this is. But you know the bull pra practice is good because it brings everybody back together and it kind of brings us towards our one purpose. Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. It's the same with bye weeks, but this one's a little bit longer. But you know everybody got back, whatever it was last week after a couple of days off, and it's just like. You know, everybody's body feels good, and it's, it's just a completely different atmosphere. It's tough to divvy out reps among like three, four people. Mm -hmm. So obviously that's tough, but uh, I've just been focused on putting in time after practice, on the weekend, stuff like that, when we're not doing anything. Just uh, try to get better myself. Which you need? Yeah, definitely competition, and uh, I'm excited for spring. I'm excited to compete, but uh, right now we're just focused on Wake Forest. Uh, we're focused on sending Brian on as a winner. We have a, we have a super tight QB room, so. Uh, that's one thing I love about this place. What do you think you've been yeah, I mean, all that? I feel like each guy has his own different skill set. You know, it's very, very, uh, it's not very common that a guy is exactly like another guy, yeah. you know. But uh, I think we're all different and uh, we all do different things well. You know, I just kind of try to go into every game and, you know, have that same mindset of just being ready, you know, because you never know what's going to happen. But, uh, you know, obviously it's been Brian's year and, uh, I thought that he's he's played well and done what he's supposed to do, and uh, you know. But other than that, I mean, just being ready, being ready all, at all times for for anything. Um, you know, there have been a few a few different practices where I'm able to get in with the first group and you know just keep focusing on doing the right thing. You know, I feel like if you the more you do the right thing, uh, things are going to work out, and just focusing on you know just doing everything the right way. Thank you, Tyler, guys. Yeah, for sure. I mean, going in and helping out the defense and being on the scout team the whole year, you know, you're away from the playbook. Uh, you're not in as many meetings, but, you know, just trying to – me and Kate are living together right now, so we're trying to just kind of stay on top of things and, and stay in the playbook and, and just keep learning, you know, grabbing a little something every day. How comfortable do you feel in that aspect and how far along, I guess, do you think you are, you know? I feel pretty good about it. You know, uh, that's probably a better co question for one of my coaches, you know, <laughs> who are – or with, uh, analyzing me, but you know I feel pretty good about it. I feel confident when I go out there and able to be able to execute. So I feel pretty good. Have those two guys been on the scout team?